First thing we do is make sure we've downloaded the software onto the PC. Once that's completed, now we'll connect the hardware. We'll connect the power to the front of the BX8. We'll connect the 6-axis load cell through the 1-6 connector on the back of the BX8. That's for one 6-axis load cell. Then we'll connect the USB from the front of the BX8 to the PC. Now we're ready to open the Blue DAC software. Now that the Blue DAC software is open, the first thing we're going to do is add the channels. So we're going to select the BX8 as a device. We're going to select the COM port. In this case, the BX8 is on COM port 3. And then we're going to open it up for six channels, one for each of the axes. Click Connect. Now we're ready to upload the information uh, for the matrix for the six axis sensor. Click Special Sensor. Then make sure multi axis is selected and click OK. Now remove any previous device that was stored on the BX8. And now add, and we're going to search through the directory to find where the .dat file is, which is the matrix information for the BX8. Serial number of this load cell is 163.02704. So we select that .dat file, click OK, and now it's uploaded that um, in here under sensor serial number. We're going to auto rename the channels. You can see now that their force and torque channels are labeled. Click OK, enable the sensor. Click OK, override existing. Password's already in there, you just click OK. And now we've already uh, uploaded the information into the BX8. We're ready to start using this information. As you can see from here, multi-axis sensor has been enabled. So we're ready to go.